damn it. Come on. Uh. Hey, could you stop crying for a minute? I'm trying to beat my score. Wait. Why are you crying? Are you okay? Hey. Mm. What's wrong? You gonna answer me? Something happened today? Hmm. All right, well. Since you won't talk to me, just listen to my voice then. <sighs> I don't know what's going on in your life right now or why you're so sad suddenly. But even I know you don't leave someone alone when they're upset like this. So, I'm here for you. I'm not great at making people feel better, but I won't leave you by yourself at least. So, if you want to tell me what's wrong already. Oh, anxiety? Are you having an anxiety attack right now? I see. Well, just try to take some deep breaths, alright? Just... Relax. Hmm. Look, I know more than anyone how unfair and cruel this world can be. I understand why you feel like everything's collapsing in on you sometimes. Because sometimes it is. It's okay to feel the way you're feeling right now. Sometimes it's hard to fight that feeling. And sometimes... It's also better to just let it all out and cry every now and then. When things get rough, there isn't really any shame in letting your emotions get the better of you here and there. I think... What makes a strong villain is getting back up on your feet. Being weak, it's okay sometimes. As long as you keep your determination in the end. <sighs> what I'm trying to say is... Sometimes things just happen. And those things are out of our control at times. But what makes us so strong is that we learn how to deal with those obstacles. One step at a time. Hmm. For example, I deal with my obstacles and anyone that pisses me off by destroying them. You just need to find a healthy outlet like me. Hmm. Oh, I saw you smile a little. See? You're gonna be okay, you brat. There's no need to worry so much. You're with us now, and the League of Villains is only getting stronger. Soon, we'll be able to take down All Might himself, I think. Plus, you've been a really nice addition to our party. You're strong, and you're pretty fearless. Honestly, I'm happy you wanted to join our League. I guess I also kinda like... spending time with you. Out of everyone else here, you actually sort of... treat me differently. You're not scared of me. And you don't call me names. In a weird way, I feel like you know me better than I know myself sometimes. And I like to think I know a lot about you, too. Well, since you talk so much when we're together. But you know what? I don't mind when you talk to me. It doesn't make me feel itchy or annoyed. I guess I sort of like when you're around. I'll stop rambling so much. Oh, you. Want me to hug you? Are you really sure about that? I don't exactly like touching people. At least not the people I like. I don't want to risk anything. Especially not with you. <laughs> oh. Well, okay. You can hug me, I guess. But I don't... want to accidentally hurt you. Fine. I'll hug you back. But don't squirm around too much. I don't want to end up turning you to dust. <sighs> I'm not used to people actually wanting to hug me. Don't tell anybody I said this, but it feels nice to be hugged like this. I never thought I'd ever feel this close to someone else. I didn't think I'd even like it. I guess it's sort of weird of me to say, especially out of nowhere, but... I like you. 
You don't annoy me nearly as much as everyone else does. And I think you've been a great help here in the League. So... I guess what I'm trying to say is... I appreciate you. Even if you feel like you have nobody who notices your efforts, or knows how hard you try. I do. I see your efforts. And I know just how valuable you really are. You've been such a big help. So... Don't be so down. Things will work out eventually if you keep pushing towards your goal, right? Hmm? Oh. Are you trying to push me down? You know, at first I never understood why you were always so touchy. And after a while, I guess I got used to it. I can understand why you like close contact so much now. It feels... nice to be close to someone you care about. Man, somehow I don't really mind you touching me now. But, don't expect me to do the same back. I don't like touching things I like. I don't want that to happen again. Huh? No. It doesn't matter if you trust me or not. It's a matter of trusting myself. So, for now at least, I'm going to keep my hands to myself. Anyways, are you tired from all that crying yet? You seem to be a little better now. Do you feel less sad? Hmm, good. As annoying as you can be sometimes, I still really like having you here. With me. In a way, I get this weird feeling in my chest when you're here. Like my heart feels warm. It's so gross. But I don't exactly hate the feeling. It's new. I've never felt this way with anyone before. At first, I thought I was sick. Or something was wrong with me. I thought maybe the years of McDonald's and takeout was finally catching up to me. But it turns out, I wasn't having a stroke or a heart attack. I was just... <sighs> I don't know whether to hate you for making me feel this way or just... Give in to these weird thoughts and emotions and just... Learn how to deal with them. I guess I don't mind these feelings. I'm not willing to let you go at this point. So, I hope I make you feel the same way. Huh? Are you dozing off on me all of a sudden? Well, that's fine then. You need your rest anyways. We can take the day off tomorrow if you want. We have no evil plan scheduled for tomorrow. I think we deserve a lazy day tomorrow anyways. As much as the others annoy me, we should all maybe spend some time together. I know Toga will be up for it. Same with Twice and Compress. Spinner too, maybe. Dobby? Oh, Dobby's annoying. You really want him around? Don't his terrible manners annoy you too? Well, I'll try and see if he wants to join us. But I doubt he will. Either way, let's have a nice day off tomorrow. It'll be for all of us. Well, I'm getting a little tired now. You seem pretty tired, too. I guess we should get some sleep now. Oh, don't go waking me up early or I'll kick you out of my room, okay? Let me sleep in, just once. Hmm. Oh, good night. I'll see you in the morning. 